Good morning, Cowboys. I'm Brianna Eckhouse, and these are your news for this week. The Athletic Booster Club will be hosting a farmer's market on Saturday, October 1st. It will begin at 9 a.m. in the student parking lot. Purchase a bag for $25 and fill your bag with as much produce as it will hold. We are in need of fresh flowers, homemade baked goods for the bake sale, and both parent and student volunteers. Please send an email to shscowboosters at gmail.com. Attention seniors, Yale University will be visiting our campus on Monday, October 3rd at 10.30 a.m. in the Career Center. College representative Julian Tamaya will be here to answer any questions you may have. Students, you need to have a teacher permission along with a pass for visits happening during class time. Attention juniors and seniors, if you want to be considered for National Honor Society, please turn in your 120 hours of community service into the Career Center by September 30th. Students interested in earning some community service hours, the CA Rodeo Salinas are looking for volunteers for the Central Coast Motorsports Spectacular at the Salinas Sports Complex on Sunday, October 2nd. Various times are available. Have a great week, Cowboys. Good morning, Cowboys. I'm Emma Garcia here today doing girl sports. And I'm Dylan DeWeese here with boys sports. Starting you off is girls tennis. On Monday, September 26th against York at Chamisol, Varsity will start at 3 o'clock. And on Tuesday, September 27th, against Christopher at Salinas, Varsity will start at 4 o'clock. And on Thursday, September 29th, against Christopher at LSL, Varsity will start at 4 o'clock. And for girls field hockey, on Monday, September 26th, against York at York, Varsity will start at 3.30. And for Wednesday, September 28th, against North Salinas at Salinas High, JV will start at 7.15 and varsity will start at 6 o'clock. On Tuesday, September 27th, the boys water polo team will be going against SoCal at SoCal. The junior varsity game will begin at 7 and the varsity game begins at 6. On Thursday, September 29th, the boys water polo team will be going against Santa Cruz at Hartnell. The junior varsity game will begin at 5 and the varsity game begins at 4. The boys cross country team will be going in a city meet on September 28th, which is a Wednesday at 3.30. And that's your sports, Cowboys. Hey, Cowboys. Welcome to To Eat or Not To Eat. That is the question. Today we will be reviewing Cantonese Express Chinese food on 928 Park Row. So let's see what happens. After thinking long and hard, we decided to rate the meal on three categories. Presentation, flavor, and service. For service, we decided to give it a three out of five stars because the ordering process was a little confusing. For presentation, we decided to give it a four out of five stars because it would look pretty organized and the plates looked pretty. For flavor, we decided to give it a three out of five stars because the food was just okay. Overall, we decided to give Cantonese Express Chinese food a three out of five stars. That's it for this week. See you later. Bye! Bye. Good morning, Cowboys. Um, it's fall has just started, and you can really see it out there now. This week it's going to be big and windy. Now, what, what would you like to tell us about the conditions today? Uh, pretty much just like you said, it's big and windy. Uh, out at Marina today, it was super choppy, and it didn't look fun at all. And it looked really bad, so we went and got snacks. Yeah. Definitely. Chris. Yeah, so days like this, get some mac and cheese and snacks from 7-Eleven and, uh, and stay at home. Yeah, stay at home, pretty much. Or you could go uh, 
Nah, there's nothing to do. Just stay at home. Yep, nothing yep. to do. It's miserable.